Extra point up and good by Suckum. And the lead is up to 18 now. Following the touchdown now, it's Bradley Pinion on to kick this one away. And this will not be returned. It'll come out to the 25. The Chiefs offense about set to begin this drive. And here we are almost through three quarters of play, and this passing game still has not really found any kind of rhythm. Put it mildly, because they're not even over 100 yards yet. And in today's NFL, where it's a pass-first league, that is quite surprising. Not many teams patient enough to stick with the run. Everybody wants to advance the ball through the air. They've got to get their timing back. He's obviously a bit of a shorter running back. And sometimes when he goes up the middle like that, he gets lost in there and then he pops out for 10, 20 yards. I actually asked NFL linebackers if that was true. Do you actually lose sight of some of the smaller running backs? And all of them confirmed that that can be a problem. Think of it this way. Two of the top running backs in NFL history, Emmitt Smith, Barry Sanders, both 5'10". A lot of times it's that first read that you have. Maybe you get it in pre-snap and he locked in on his target, but he was covered quite well, and that one's incomplete. Throwing is Mahomes on third. He's got his man, that's Hardman. And he'll be brought down on what's going to turn out to be the final play of this third quarter. One quarter remains here on a Sunday night. You're watching the NFL on EA Sports. Mahomes now on first down. Throwing the out route incomplete. It's Hill. And past the 35, he'll be dropped a yard or two shy of the 30. From the 32 now, here's first and 10. Now Mahomes. Flushed out right, and he slides and covers up at the end as he's going to be able to pick up decent yardage. The improv on the scramble there gets him six, and then it'll be second down. Mahomes going to throw. And this throw a bit late as he couldn't reach back for it. At this point in the game, they've got to continue to try anything they can. They're still working at it, even though this one feels like a lost cause. They go play action. Now Mahomes. And here is a leaping catch. He pulled it in. And they are able to stop him, but he does take it all the way to the two. Well, I can put my defensive cap on right now, and I know they're saying don't give up any big plays now. They've controlled this game throughout, and all they want to do is see it through to the end. I think they let their guard down a little bit with that last completion. Sometimes when you're trying not to give up bigger plays, you don't react as fast as you should on other throws. Two minutes left to play in this football game here on EA Sports. Second down and goal, Mahomes. This is caught by Hill for a Chiefs touchdown. Two yards on the touchdown there. And the Chiefs are finally into the end zone here in this fourth quarter. Extra point by Butker is on target. And that'll make this now an 11-point deficit. Two scores down, three timeouts left. Still a chance if they can somehow get this one back. And the Buccaneers able to recover. Their hands team does its job. And he is out of bounds inside the 35. They knew they needed a miracle. They had to have that onside kick. They didn't get it. Well, as we knew, even before they put the, the toe to the leather on that one, their chances of getting that done, slim, and none. And I do believe we saw Slim just leave the door. To Touchdown, Tampa Bay! Mike Evans, 33 yards. And the Bucs have put this one to bed here in the fourth quarter. They were still throwing with a comfortable lead here late, and now that lead even more comfortable. And your first thought is, is there bad blood that went into this one ahead of time that maybe they're seeking some revenge or they just don't like them? But the other thing that always hits me is, 
Are they worried about playoff positioning? Right? Are they worried about do you need enough points in case there's a tiebreaker that comes into play later? Extra point put through by Suckup, and the lead is up to 18 now. Now Pinion with a kickoff honors following the touchdown. And he'll just sit on this one as their drive will start at the 25. The KC offense out of the huddle, ready for their next drive. Let's just be frank. They're playing for pride at this point. <laughs> <laughs> that's, that's all that's left because victory, not a chance now. And I can't wait to see how they actually go about doing it because there are a lot of people watching the body language of the guys on the field now. And if they call plays they want executed, they need to do that and do it really well. Otherwise, there could be repercussions. We'll see how they handle the waning moments of this one. Mahomes looking to throw on third and two. He is going to find Hill here. And he will have a Chiefs first down as they're able to get the third down conversion. Mahomes throw here complete to Kelsey. Seven yards, the pick up there. They're going to need to get up and set in a hurry. Oh, the Buccaneer pressure too much. Down he goes. The Chiefs will use the first of their timeouts as they get the stoppage with a little over 50 seconds left to go in the game. From the gun on third down, Mahomes. And a throw there going to be incomplete. Boy, it just seems like all game long there hasn't been a lot of sync quarterback to wide receiver on this side of the football. They haven't been on the same page, quarterback and receivers. Heck, they haven't been on the same grease board when you draw plays up. They haven't been on the same surface tablet that you look at on the sidelines. Nothing's worked for them. They've got to find a way to start matching each other's movements. Now whistles come in. We're going to get a timeout here by the offense. As they'll stop it with a little over 30 ticks to go in the football game. Mahomes now to throw. And that is incomplete. He couldn't hold on through the contact. Brings up second down. As his old brain remembers, when I see five wide receivers on the field as a defender, I know the ball's coming out hot. They expected it and got there and popped it free. Complete the tight end, Kelsey. Five yards, now it's third and five. The Chiefs quickly now going to use the last of their timeouts as they'll stop it with 13 seconds left to play. They'll break the huddle and come up on the ninth play of this drive, needing five yards on third down. And a quick throw here, that's complete. And he will have a Chiefs first down as they're able to get the third down conversion. So fire the cannons. It's a victory here for Tampa Bay. And you look back over the score sheet, interesting. A very clean game, no turnovers by either side. An absolute rarity when we watch games now because defenses have put such an emphasis on taking the ball away. Well, what we saw here was offense is spending their time saying, look, you know they're coming for it. Ball security is paramount. So they worked on that, not just a week of practice, but I'm sure all during training camp. Make sure when you have it, tuck it away because danger lurks everywhere you turn. So that'll just about do it for Charles Davis. I'm Brandon Gordon. You've been watching the NFL on EA Sports. For more, log on to easports.com. With that, we say good night from Kansas City.